What's good with it? It's your boy Mr. Mixer and I'm back with another how-to video in Adobe Audition. Alright, today we're going to make a lead track into dubs, okay? We're going to turn it into multiple voices and we're going to widen it out into the stereo field and I'm going to show y'all how to do that. Let's get into it. Alright everybody, before we get into this video, I need you to like or dislike the video. Um, it helps out with the algorithm. Let me know what you think about the video and let's get into it. Yeah. All right, let's get into this session. All right, so right now I have pulled up the same session that we have been working on. And what we're going to do, what I've done is broken down these dubs that I actually did. Now what we're learning is how to turn one vocal into multiple dubs and multiple voices, okay? Not just a dub, but just uh, maybe some harmonies or some just effects. We'll see what we're gonna do. I'm gonna show you that here in a second, but we're not gonna dub, like actually dub it with the mic. That would be my first thing to do. Dub that, then turn your vocals in or do whatever the effect is, you know, without having to do it in an effect. Just do it with your voice, okay? So that would be method one, okay? But we're not going to do that, so let's get into let's get into it. All right. I do want to say that doing regular dubs and doing your own harmonies will always come out better. I'm letting you know it will feel more realistic it will always be better than um, touching it with the computer all right so what I'm gonna do is I duplicated this track all right so let me see what part I want to do we started at the bottom now we at the top I always had a fear of the fame is non-stop and we ooh, and we ooh, and we grind non-stop Okay, so, yeah, because I wanted to do this a little different anyway. I've just been showing y'all things on here. Okay, so let's duplicate this right here. And we, ooh, and we grind nonstop. Okay, so we do not want that. We want to take this. Okay, so let's right-click on it. All right, convert to unique copy. All right, that's going to change your file all the way down the middle, okay? All right, next thing I would do is I would... Go into edit menu, all right? All right, we're gonna go to effects. Let's go to time and pitch. Let's go to stretch and pitch, all right? Now, these settings are set for a low voice, okay? Now, every time I play with the time and pitch, the stretch and pitch um, effect, I have to do it by multiples of the even numbers, okay? The even numbers is where the the sweet spots is for me um so typically for a for i guess a low voice you would do negative 12 so okay so that would give you a little monster voice which is cool if you want that for this one i don't so we're going to start at negative six so we go from negative 12 well let's say zero negative three negative six, negative nine, negative 12, and threes. That's that's what it really is, threes. But it's always an even number, okay? Well, the three. Anyway, I'm gonna show y'all my method to doing this, okay? All right, so negative six. And we grind nonstop. Okay, now that gives me like a lower harmony with that, okay? So let's see what it feels like. And we okay i don't want that okay so this is where once you figure out that's not it you want to play with the uh different voices okay so honestly you just play with it and we, mm, and we grind non-stop find the right one just go up one by one or down and we, mm, and we grind non-stop i'm not sure if i want to go uh, down I might want to go up okay so let's try that with a up and I want to play it first 
and we mm, and we grind nonstop, and we. Okay, at least feel digital. And we, mm, okay, not that key. Okay, all right. And we and we cry. Nah. Alright, so let's go up one. And we and we cry. Okay, and I think I know why. Okay, so what we're gonna do go up to six. Okay, six and twelve, like I told you, has always really worked for me. I don't Okay, and I just, I honestly just don't like the the highness of the voice or the lowness. I don't like anything as far as that. So, I'm not doing that, alright? You have to play with it to see what you're not going to do, alright? So, I know that I'm not going to do that. So, what we're going to do is move on. Alright, so, we're going to leave voice regular, alright? But what we're going to do is we're going to take this track and duplicate it twice, alright? Now this is dub, let me put this up here. These are the ones we're working with right here, okay? So let's say work on, work on, all right? Now we're gonna go get a tool called the delay. All right, um, delay and echo, then go to delay. All right, so how we use this baby right here. Okay, so what we're gonna tell it, all right, our delay time, let's set this back to zero, okay? We're gonna start in the middle, all right? Let's say we are in a stereo field, okay? Left, center, and right, okay? So, we're in the middle right now, all right? So, well, the time is in the middle, okay? Um, we wanna turn the wet all the way up because we want it to act 100% in this ear a little bit, you know? So, we're gonna pan it actually to 100 negative 100 we're gonna pan the other one to 100 all right and with this baby right here we want to create a delay time in our left field our left side of our ears you know like go to the negatives okay so just kind of look at the the bars and you'll see it makes sense all right we start out with negative one we don't want to go too wide all right we're gonna try to make this feel like a few different voices, like it's really done. All right, that one's gonna go to one, same way. All right, so let's see how it feels. Okay, so yeah, let's see. Okay, honestly, it's not enough for me. All right, so I'm gonna probably go too far just so I can figure out where I want to stop it okay so from here let's turn it down I want to say dramatically but that's not really dramatic negative 8.5 on the decibel on the turning down Okay, so that sounds pretty full. I like that really. Okay, so for these backgrounds though, we would I, I still would want it to feel a little bit more full. So if I was to do that, I would take another one. I would put this pan. Let's go to uh negative 75, okay? And let's put our delay. Um Let's try negative seven, okay? All right, and what I wanna do for this is just duplicate this so I can cross do the other side, okay? Same way, all right, my delay is done. All right, so on these, I wanna bring out my low pass, okay? So let's bring that dramatically down. I don't want any highs on these two right here, okay? All right, so don't get lost in the sauce on these. Like, just look at your pans. You'll understand where you are. Uh, color code them um, if you need to. All right, so let's see how that feels. All right, so. All right, 
Okay, so what we're gonna do now that we have a base, I wanna take this one. Um, let me make sure, convert, I always convert to unique. All right, I wanna do that low voice that I did. I can hide that in there. That'd be pretty cool. Um, so we're just gonna take this down to negative 12. We're gonna start there, all right. Let's turn this one off for a second. And we ooh, and we cry. And we ooh. Okay, so what we're gonna do is take that and duplicate that there. Let's turn that back on. And we ooh, and we cry nonstop. Okay, so these would be treated probably with some distortion. Um, let's grab some distortion. I like using this. I like using um the guitar suite, that's pretty sweet. I like using the low fidelity, lowest fidelity. That's pretty cool. All right, so I wanna add that twice. Okay, let's do. Okay, so I have these lows. Okay, so the lows will come down, okay? All right, so let's turn down to about negative 15. That is a good start. Way more. Okay, these lows, I want to bring out a little more delay in it. Okay, so let's take it to about negative 10. All right, and on this one, we put 10. On these lows, we did. A way more wide feeling. Um, I could probably pull it back a little bit now. Okay, so this is a effect that I do, but I don't really do it. So I'm just, it's for y'all. Um, so yeah, let me see. Okay, I want to play that whole thing. We started at the bottom, now we at the top. I always had a fear of the fame is nonstop. And we do, and we do, and we grind nonstop. We started at the bottom, now we at the top. I always had a fear of the fame is nonstop. And we do, and we do, and we grind nonstop. Okay. I like the way it feels, okay? <clears throat> I might keep it this way because I like that feel a little bit better and maybe tweak it a little bit more, but I'm liking that, okay? Um, so, boom, we are done with this video. Um, we took one one take and turned it into multiple takes, all right? So, um, work on your panning. Make sure you rewind and get the panning right. Um, that is one thing that's going to make the vocal water and going to spread it out for your ears to hear and it's going to sound great. So just practice this technique, work on the delay trick and copying and pasting and all that great stuff. So anyway, I hope I helped somebody out in this video. OK, yeah. Anyway, I'm out this thing. It's your boy, Mr. Mixer. I'll be back for more heat heat. OK, so let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. And we do, and we grind nonstop. We started at the 